The Jazz may be slumping, but Jimbo Rudding is still bringing it. Jimbo is our resident mailbag artist, providing a regular dose of levity here at Salt City Hoops. He does it by answering the burning questions to which jazz fans just must have answers. You can submit questions to Jimbo at mailbag at saltcityhoops.com or by tweeting you're at the pool and you just yelled, Mom, watch my new sideways dive. That's literally the only time diving sideways makes sense. It certainly doesn't make sense in a professional basketball game. I want to go on record and say that I don't know if Dion Waiters was intentionally trying to hurt Rudy Gobert, but I will go on record and say that Waiters wasn't making a basketball play when he tumbled sideways into the Jazz Center's legs. In fact, I have no idea what he was trying to do. It surely wasn't going after the ball. So, was it a dirty play? Yes. Is Dion Waiters a dirty player? Also, yes. Are there a lot of dirty players? Probably. Do I enjoy asking myself questions in an effort to sound smart when I answer them? Undoubtedly so. Q the Celtics are 13 to 1 without Hayward and 0 to 1 with him. You think they would consider offloading his contract with a first round pick in exchange for Hood and Rubio? Question mark at cool underscore cool they do it. Not only for the fact that Hayward is good at basketball, but also because we'd have him for the next four years and he wouldn't have a say in it. Sounds like a good way to get him back for the crap he put us all through last summer. The best part about the trade would be the thank you, Gordon Post the Celtics would release in the Players' Tribune.